they change the statues, that's on pride. Oh my god, I can't lie. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my god, the devil had my soul, I can't lie. Hey, hey, they had me change the statues, that's on pride. Oh my god, I can't lie. Hey, hey, hey. He's like, my name's Kanye, and my hey bro, it's great to meet you. I heard that you've been visiting some, I haven't seen you, I'm glad that you ain't hung out today so we can talk. He said, Pastor, I gotta, I gotta talk to you for a minute. And I'm like, yeah, man, what's up? He said, about five weeks ago, I got radically saved. Mm. And I'm like, hey, man, what does that mean? What do you mean you got radically saved? And he just started telling me a little bit of his testimony. And, you know, it basically went something like he was raised knowing that, that God existed. He was told about Christ, that his dad was a Christian counselor, that he had been in church, and uh, that he'd been running from God, you know, and he made it big in the industry. And as a. Oh, my God, the devil had my soul. I can't lie. He just started chasing all the things of this world, but he said that it basically he just um, felt so uh, a weight of sin and the guilt of sin brought him down low. And he would say, you know, the devil basically just brought him to a place where he just felt like he was in bondage to his sin. And so he said, I got delivered. You know, so when you hear stuff like that, you want to verify that. So I'm like, hey man, I'd like to talk to you. What, what do you mean about that? And so he had to go. He said, hey man, I'm, I'm going to go do Sunday service that Sunday afternoon in Calabasas, which is a suburb of LA. At the time, they were doing a Sunday service just for uh, his family and some close friends. And I didn't really even know what he was talking about. Oh my God, the devil had my soul. I can't lie. They, they, they had me change the statues. That's so proud. Oh my God, I can't lie. Uh, but we scheduled an appointment, and so a couple of weeks later, he came in for like three hours. And so uh, at that particular meeting is when I had a little bit better confidence in at least seeing God at work in him, as I just talked about all these doctrines we're talking about right now. Right. You know, just, just open up the Bible to the Roman road and open up to Ephesians 2, 8, and 9, and John 14, 6, and John 3, 16, and just talk about it verse by verse and explain it and talk about it. What do you think, Kanye? Is this what you're saying? What do you believe this verse means? Do you see this truth? Do you understand what, what the Bible teaches about this? And he's like, bro. Oh my God, the devil had my soul, I can't lie. They, they, they had me change the statues, that's on pride. Oh my God, I can't lie. They, they, they. Oh my God, the devil had my soul, I can't lie. They, 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 they had me change the statues, that's on pride. Oh my God, I can't lie. He was ready to move on to issues of sanctification. In yeah. his mind, it was a done deal. He, he, he seemed to just have a pretty good uh, beat on soteriology and pretty confident that it was all Christ, that he's born again, he's forgiven of his sin, he, he, you know, and he wants to walk with Jesus. It was super cool. I mean, when I got on stage, Kanye looks at me and says, well, now he's get up on the podium and just start playing. I go, okay. It was so impromptu in some ways. I mean, we did a, a slight rehearsal, but he's very creative and on the spot just comes up with some super good ideas. Let's not be concerned with the opinions of men at all. Let's not be concerned with the validation of men at all. Only of God. This is the culture, and that's the culture. To be radically in service to Christ is the only culture that I want to know about. We call on, yeah, Van. We come call on, your blessing. We call on, yeah, Van. We come call on, your blessing. Thank you for saving me, for replenishing me, for delivering me.
catch you. Have me chasing cars, have me chasing numbers. The power of God cannot be calculated by a number, by a first week sale, by a Inside of us is God inside of family, it's God inside of friendship that we hold each other accountable. If you see somebody slipping, you tell them. They be coming at me like, why are you so judgmental? It ain't for me to judge, but I'ma say what I see. That's another thing the devil try to do. Why, why you keep on speaking up so much? I'm just pointing to the world. If it's a household next to yours that's lacking a father, you that father now. You speak up on that block. You set that example. In Christ Jesus. Christ Jesus. Amen. 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 I want to say I yeah. love the fact that my daughter wants to go to church, church and her, she has such a positive thought association to going to church because it's outside of the traditional four walls and outside of the pews and now that God has called me and I've, I now have given my life to Jesus Christ and I work for God. in complete service to God. Do you the feel the born again? The, <laughs> Do you feel yeah. born again, yeah. Honey? Do you feel like, yeah. Would you consider yourself to be a Christian music artist now? I'm just a Christian everything. Uh-huh. Everything. everything. Before I start sure. quoting or misquoting scripture. Sure. sure. Yeah. Yeah, you're on a journey. Yes. God was patient and my family, all they could do yeah. was pray yeah. and be patient and it had to happen in God's time. So God. I can't do it Lord. I can't keep it to myself. I can't stand and be still. Everybody I will tell. Everybody I will tell In the case, Lord of Lords I can't keep it to myself I can't sit here and be 
suffer. suffer. much hate and love can cure so much just to think am i moving in love it's just out of love not out of pride Just to think, am I moving in love? It's just out of love, not out of pride. Pride is a word that people often say in a positive connotation, but it's actually one of the seven deadly sins. And it takes too much ownership, but you can replace pride with love. And when I see people just even like go at the president, it's like, why not try love for one person to stand up against all odds? and just hug somebody. bomb of hate that we're in as a society by thinking of everyone as a family. I work for Christ. Christ has, God has supernatural powers. He can cover all of this, but I still am human. And when I was serving my ego, and serving my legacy, serving my culture, serving my city, all this kind of stuff. Love, 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 love
some more experiences to be able to cast a wider net when he was ready to use it. country where we allowed to like whatever we like i love jesus christ a lot of us in those four walls it felt like we were stuck in the pews so like what we said 10 years ago that you inspired for me to go there we are now jesus, actualizing please, that jesus, jesus.